Hello and welcome to Fab and Freedom in the Air's second event live from Red Hill Aerodrome. Today we have 20 members from three different Fab clubs ranging from ages 8 all the way up to 60 and above all taking 30 minute flights, a little bit of inclusive flying, taking over the controls and just generally having a great day. Off you go kids! I'm here to have fun and fly a plane. I've come here today with my nan, my mum and dad and my sister. All week she hasn't stopped going on about flying an aeroplane. It's amazing. I love it. I love planes. I'm not scared but I'm going to close my eyes during the flight. If you don't know what a plane is, it has wings and it flies in the air. This is the altimeter. Our young FAB members had a fantastic opportunity last year to fly. It was amazing to see how when they came out of that plane, the confidence that they had gained. It's important that we provide opportunities not just for existing FAB members, but that we reach out to others who haven't been involved in FAB and allow new people to experience the things that FAB members can do. With FAB, people have the opportunity to take part in shows at local theatres. They get a chance to do climbing, they get a chance to do water sports, and now they have the opportunity to fly. What connects all the different types of FAB members is inclusion. They want to do things together, they want to support each other, other. There are the people in the plane, there are people on the ground supporting their other FAB members. When we stepped out of the car he had no idea what he was going to do um, but now he's going to be flying a plane and he's going to be in charge, commander of the plane. That's me! <laughs> How do you think you fly a plane? It's easy. Today will be my best day ever. I love it dad. FAB gave me an opportunity to do things that I never thought I'd be able to do. To show other people that people with a, dis with a disability can do a some item or whatever it is, we can do it too. Today is going to be my dream of taking control of a plane. Well, she's always cheerful, whatever life throws at her, and she's gone through quite a lot, I'm afraid. Today, I'll become a pilot. Guess who's back? There's a plane in the sky! And look, there are planes on my plate. How do they get from up there to down there? Today, with the pilot James, he had control. He kept the wings level, he was turning the airplane and he was talking to the other traffic. <laughs> I now know how to fly a plane. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Yay! Yeah. Was it awesome? Yeah. Yay! 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 Was that good? Yay! Yay. Was that good? In my plane ride, I drove to Heathrow Castle and back and saw all the wonderful sights. That's Heathrow Castle down there. That, that, that's where Anne Berlin used to live. On my plane ride, I rode over Heathrow Castle and the views were great, it was amazing. What I will never forget is being in control of a plane in the sky. I will never forget that because I felt freedom in the air. Working last year with Fab and Freedom in the Air, we realised what an impact we could have on making aviation accessible to everyone. And this year and in the future, we want to continue having that impact and working with everyone to help ensure aviation is inclusive and available to everyone. He's done things like this, he's done camping, he's done um, trampolining and it's great just to see the kids having lots of fun and the values of him is that he understands people from all different backgrounds, all different abilities and the great fun they have together as children and tonight I know he's going to be dreaming about flying an aeroplane. I teach in an independent school and it's uh, incredibly selective. Uh, disability access is <laughs> nigh on. <laughs> well, it's, 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 not, it's, it's, it's not there, it's, it's not visible at all. So what does a teenager need to survive in life? Well, they need patience, they need resilience, 
They need the ability to communicate. They need an ability to discern a skill set within each individual person. And that's what FAB gives. That's what FAB gives to us and to our boys and to our schools. They come in and they enable us to understand need, they understand diversity of our society in which we live in. Thank, thank you, Fab. Thank you, Fab. Peace out. <laughs>